This is an old traditional sea song that fishermen used to chant on their long fishing and diving trips. In the past, Emiratis who lived by the coastline depended on fishing and diving to survive. Today, lulu harvesting or pearl harvesting is a big part of our UAE's heritage. And here in Qas al Hassan, it is presented daily and live for you to watch and learn. with us today. You're French Canadian. Yes. And you're with Don't us collect. here. Perfect. <laughs> and you're here with us today because you're interested in heritage, culture, and everything from the past. It's fascinating. Uh, this is something that we don't see very often. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. Oh, as you can see, Roger, we have the, our oysters, and our father here will tell us exactly the steps how to look for the pearls. This is called mafliga. Mafliga. This is the oyster. Okay. This is how it's open. He does it easily. Yes. But I'm sure it could be compli yes. more complicated than it looked like. It's a living creature. You know how oysters are. So, so the pearl usually is here. Usually they're very small pearls that they can find in such oysters. So he looks either inside here or at the borders. I see. If, if there's no pearl, does he eat? Uh, it yes. Does it eat? Yes. Yeah. 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 They remove the flesh yes. and they use it for eating. They eat okay. it. Okay, great. So nothing is lost? Nothing. And they can put this in their uh, fishing tools to uh, catch fish for fishing. Ah, because of the color. So yes, and even uh, with the little flesh that fish would eat. Usually a boat like this has 30 sailors. <laughs> 10 divers and 10 on the board of the ship. So two people would chunk the oysters. And the Nukhda is like the captain. There are two. المالك اللي هي السفينة They have a cook on the ship. There's a boy. Yes. شو يسوي الولاد so they have trainees also, they call them tabab. Eight years old, ten years old. They teach, they teach them how to die. How long does it take for to train? Four months, ten days for the big uh, fishing diving trip. Life is rich, and the work on the ship is hard but organized. We mingled with the Nukhda, who is the captain of the ship, or the captain of the Mihmal, and he refreshed our memories on some of the authentic, uh, traditional tools that were used for diving and fishing. See, underneath here, they put all their tools. It's like two stories. The ship is two, two, two stories. <laughs> Thank you. 
اور فادر مشكور وبولنا على صراحة معلومات القيمة اللي عطيتنا إياها شكرا جزيلا and as we learn the tools the مفلقة yes. الحطام the rock that we used for diving I hope you enjoy today's lesson I, for me it was uh, eye opening uh, and you know the hospitality in the way you could feel the warm of this of this uh, of this battery ash if I may say it, it's fantastic yeah, I mean. very happy to have you here and we were happy to have you here that we took a tour on the marine life back yes. in the past how they used to dive for pearls we found a pearl and yes you, you got already you just need a ring now <laughs> I think we'll do that. and I hope you enjoyed our tour today and our trip with Roger and hopefully we'll see you tomorrow with a different aspect from the past life here in Qasr Qasr Festival Thank you very much.